think two guys who work on camera do a better thing with us? So it's pretty bad.
oh, we raised $5,000 and it can come on this trip, and it's actually a lot of piece of shit for money to raise, and it's hard to do. And, and you were raising money. You were doing pretty, pretty, pretty horribly. She's a terrible fundraiser. <laughs> That's why I called me and I said, well, um, So she got, said, I said, do what you have to do, I said. But she had three, $300? Yeah, $365. Okay, and so I was exaggerating. You know it a little better, but it's not really close to 5,000. Seriously? Okay, so a few weeks ago, I was at, well, two weeks ago, I was at 365, and Okay, and one of my best friends works at a pizza place, I used to work there as well, and she had found out that another gentleman that worked there, and I had worked with him too, but we hadn't talked in two or three years since I went there, that he had a little extra cash and that I should maybe go talk to him about getting a donation. And I was kind of hesitant in doing that, but I was like, well, what do you say to somebody? Like, hey, I heard you have money and I'm trying to go to Haiti. Like, no. <laughs> so, she texted me later, it's like, I set it all up, it's fine. And I went and I talked to him, and he told me that, um, oh my gosh, crack. That, basically, that, <laughs> <laughs> that essentially I'm the reason that he's still alive. Um, that he had been going through a lot of hard times, and that I was the only person that had been continually nice to him through this whole thing. And I had no idea that he had ever struggled with anything at all. He was just a really nice kid. And he gave me the other $4,635 so that I could go to So this sums up on YouTube. Thank you. <laughs>